News Channel 8 is your official Bucks station, and tonight Bucks fans are not just packing the stands, they're also packing food pantries. Feeding Tampa Bay paired up with Mosaic and the Buccaneers to collect items for families in need this holiday season. Olivia Steen joins us now live from outside Ray J. Good evening, Olivia. Good evening, Marco. Well, this afternoon, there were six different treasure chests set up around Raymond James Stadium for anyone who wanted to give back to their food drive. It's no secret that pirates love their treasure and riches, but on Sunday, many of them are giving theirs away. Thank you so much. Canned veggies, box foods, or any non perishable items. Feeding Tampa Bay is collecting it all. We made sure we brought what we could. The goal is to tackle hunger around the Tampa Bay region through food pantries. The first one opened up last month. It's a mission Toby Collard tells me he's willing to stand behind. Not only this time of year, but all times of the year, people need help. And we go to the Bucks games, obviously, we're fortunate enough to have tickets. There's people that aren't as fortunate that not only can be with us, but, you know, need a helping hand, and uh, it just feels good to be a part of that. These QR codes were also available for anyone wanting to make a monetary donation. Mike Randall with Mosaic says every penny counts. One dollar uh, provides 10 meals, so being able to provide a monetary donation goes further. This is why Jose Santiago says he had to make a stop at the treasure chest. For me, that's a no-brainer. I see it, and I'm about Tampa Bay. I'm from here, and I'm happy to give. The Bucks and Mosaic are also donating $10 for each tackle made during the regular season. All proceeds go to feeding Tampa Bay. Live in Tampa, Olivia Steen, 8 on your side.